So I'm gonna take one package of lean ground turkey and some taco seasoning and cook those together in a skillet. While that's cooking, I just wanna show you my new bento boxes I got on Amazon. I'll link it below for you, but they're perfect for the serving sizes that I use. Now I'm just gonna get my four containers all ready to go so I can get my food put in. Now while my meat is browning, I have this Uncle Ben's whole grain Santa Fe medley that I cook, it only takes about 90 seconds. Then I'm just gonna split it up into the four containers so it's about a half a cup per container. Now I just eyeball it so I just make it as even as possible. Next I'm gonna add my salad. If you don't wanna put your salad in yet, that's okay, I like my Southwest burrito bowl cold. So I just add about a half a cup to a cup of salad into each bowl. Now as I put the salad on, I'm also actually browning my meat on the side. All right, once my meat is done, my taco seasoning is added. I'm just gonna split that into fourths and just add it to each bowl. Now this was one pound of lean ground turkey and so each serving will have about a fourth of a pound of ground turkey. Now if you don't like the taste of ground turkey, you can easily use ground beef instead. Next I'm gonna add my corn. So this is low sodium canned corn. I love when I can use fresh corn when it's in season, but when it's not in season, I just use the canned. So I use about a fourth of a can for each bowl. The next ingredient is your favorite salsa. I love the fresh salsa or the pico. Um, you can get it at any grocery store, you can make it yourself. There's hardly any calories and it just adds that boost of flavor for you. So I added about three tablespoons into each bowl. And then last I just added a little bit of cheese onto each bowl, about two tablespoons. Not a lot, but I really like cheese. Now I'm going to put this Taco Bell mild sauce on top and it's great because there are no calories, no fat, no carbs, there's only a little bit of sodium. So it's perfect if you're trying to lower your calories. Now I add my taco sauce as I'm about ready to eat it. So when you're all done, you just put the lids on, you pack them on top of each other or however they fit in your fridge and you are good to go. Now these should last you 